After a long time we are talking about the Pixel Experience Plus edition for the Redmi Note 8 users. I tried this custom room. The previous update had bug like the orange fox recovery was not working, the data was not visible in the recovery and some users were having issues with they were stuck at the home screen of that orange fox custom recovery. So that was kind of weird but this update has no issues. I tested it, I'm using it for some time, unofficial build based on android version 11, it's not android version 12 by the way. We're talking about the Android version 11 Pixel Experience Plus Edition unofficial build, which has the Quicksilver kernel pre installed for you. The default kernel is Quicksilver. You get the October security patch. The thing is, it's good. If you're a Pixel lover, if you always use Pixel Experience custom rooms, or if you love to use these custom rooms, then you will definitely love this one. As expectedly, it comes with the Pixel Launcher pre installed. The Pixel Launcher has the features which you want in your custom in your, in your launcher as your daily driver things, but it does not include icon size, icon pack related customizations. You can drive it some magic modules like Launcher Launcher, you can install Shady Launcher, Pixel Lady Launcher, the Pixel Mode, and a lot more things which you can do if you want to. Let's just straight away talk about the safety net status. First of all, if you want to root your device, yes, you can with the Magisk latest version 23 is what I am using right now on my device and didn't got any kind of boot loop, etc. Let's just talk about the safety net status. As you just saw, the safety net status does not have any kind of issues. Safety net status is passing. If safety net status is passing, which means you'll be able to use banking apps, you'll be able to use all the things which requires safety net status to be passed. So no issues there. But of course you need to hide magic in settings this is the thing you need to keep in mind but if you don't hide magic you might get the safe net error but if you don't root your device no worries the safe net status still should be passed without root i'm not sure about that i have rooted my device but if you haven't so you can give it a try or you can root and hide magic the camera does not have any kind of issues it contains the MIUI camera for you Right now, MIUI camera is one of the best cameras out there, especially for these devices. You can see the watermark is Redmi Note 8 Pixel, and yes, it's good. That's a MIUI camera which you get pre installed. Let me just talk about the 48 megapixel here, and here we have the details available for this 22 MB of size, it's 648, 48 megapixel cam is working perfectly fine. Including that if you don't want to use the normal MIUI camera or if you're not interested in that anymore, you can drive the Google camera also. I'm using this latest Google camera by Arvana Soft, it's just good. Arnova's, Arnova's latest Gcam is what I'm using right now on my device. I have made a video on that one and will upload on my Hindi channel very very soon. So if you haven't subscribed my Hindi channel yet, make sure to check out that link already available on my channel's list in YouTube homepage. Here we have all these themes available for you which are pre-installed by default in this Pixel Experience Plus edition. I've already played the crayon theme which is working perfectly fine you just saw but you also have five more themes so for example if you want to change the grid size etc you can do that styles etc wallpapers etc everything what you can do styles and wallpapers of course present all the pixel wallpapers are already available here for you you can apply those the live wallpapers are not recommended for you for example if i try to apply this new theme here which you had pre-installed the fonts have been changed, the quick settings panel have been changed and like this you can customize a lot of things. Also you can see the quick settings has two, uh, two rows and five columns. You can also adjust this. Pixel Experience Plus does not have many or major customizations but some customizations which you use on your device as your daily driver things already present here. Or you can try out some alternatives like Pixel Extended and we have a Pixel Blaster OS, Pixie S OS. A lot of options are already available for you. It does not include app locker unfortunately you have the face unlock you have the fingerprint unlock but you don't get the app locker if you need app locker you can try out some custom launchers if you don't want to use ads or a sector because if you install any kind of ad bug if you install any kind of app locker from google play store you might face some free things or you can ads etc if you want to use app locker you can try out some magic modules for the custom launchers it has the app locker already available for you it has some bit of customizations in status bar, clock customizations, traffic, etc, battery, etc. Everything is there for you. If you want to install this build, link to install this build is already in the description. I'm not going to talk about the installation process because it's install the room and reboot. Everything else is just kind of same. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and share this video. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe me. Also, I'll see you in the next video. Until then, goodbye.
feel like I'm floating through the air 